What's up, everybody? It's me, San Martin, and guess what? I am on the scene, but I am here at the Prescott Executive Offices in the studio, and I got a special guest. But guess what? You're going to have to wait to hear about this man's business and all that he does for Prescott, Arizona, because we got to do the intro, and it goes like this. All right, so as you guys know, I like to go around and I like to find out a lot of things that are happening in our community, but it's also a better uh, opportunity to talk with people that are partnering up with the Prescott Times. And this is one that everybody needs, especially all you business owners and people that are running any kind of facility and, and such, because guess what? The man has something that you need. Without further ado, tell everybody who you are and what makes you famous. <laughs> Yes, I'm John Gillis. I'm the owner of A1 Office Plus here in Prescott, Arizona. Uh, We are the only locally owned office supply company in Prescott and actually in the three cities here, Prescott Valley and Chino also. Uh, We just furnish basic office supplies to everyone in the community. Uh, He he makes it seem so like uh, it's just what we do. But you guys don't understand. (laughs) We all need this stuff. I mean, like no matter what, if you're running a facility, like you have it all and and you've I been in all. the business for how, uh, how long in Prescott? I've been in Prescott for 23 years. Oh my I've, gosh. I've had the business here for 23 years. Uh, I've split this off, off a family company that we had in California. I shouldn't say that, but <laughs> yes, I am from California, it is, but it, I, it is I, what it is. It's a part I came of the here and States. I embraced Prescott. I did not try to change it. You know, I kind of uh, laugh at it because sometimes I'm just like, well, it's still part of the United States. And I actually like California. It's really it's beautiful. Be- it is beautiful, but uh, we had to get out of there. And we did. So we love it here. Uh, I have a f- wife and two kids. The kids have grown up and they both live down in the Phoenix area. Uh, but it was a family business. I just split up from it. It was... Uh, Actually, I'm third generation. My grandfather started it. Uh, he had a typewriter shop in Hawthorne, California. Uh, started that back in 1952. Then his sons, which was my dad and his brother, uh, took it over. Um, uh, my uncle was killed in an automobile accident a long time oh, no. ago. but uh, So my dad took it over. And then our, the three, his three sons, which I'm one of, took the business over. And we've since kind of gone our different ways. I came over here. My older brother went the corporate route. My younger brother still has what what is the family business back in. He's in San Pedro, California right now. Oh, wow. That's so crazy. So we know office supplies. We've been doing it our whole life. Uh, a lot it, of it's just, yeah old stuff that doesn't pertain anymore, but a lot of it's new stuff. And and we have it all for you. We, you know, the best part about, you know, the things that you're doing is, is it's it's a it's a product that's obviously needed on a regular basis. So, let's, I mean, let's go down from. uh like if you have a starting point of a to z i mean is there anything that you do not provide for businesses we don't do printing okay well that that was and we don't do shredding uh that would be parts of what you may call a full service office supply company uh we do mostly everything else we do office supplies we do toners uh, you know paper the pens all that all the imaging supplies the inks uh all that for we do janitorial supplies a lot of people don't think of us for that we do the paper towels for your dispensers uh, all kinds of cleaning chemicals and so forth is available and we also different it's kind of in the same category but it's called break room supplies so we have we're a keurig dealer so we have all kinds of coffees and uh things that you would use in your break room wow that's and, so you insane. know we're not we're probably not going to be cheaper than the grocery store but they're not delivering it to your desk. And well, that, that is, it, that's so. actually a really big deal because yeah. in most cases, uh, some businesses are, are really, I mean, if, if you, we could cut the cost and the time on a lot of things like that, that's kind of like the mentality mode that I'm going with. And I had uh, my buddy on earlier, Niles from a tech company. And it's just like, you know, that's one of the things we don't want to mess with, with the tech company. And so, you know, it, it's just like when you have the accommodations, utilize them. So well, when you talk about businesses, I know that we, we've we chatted. Can you tell the, uh, the the community what kind of businesses are you looking for as far as like the call to action? Oh, I, you know, the some of our best customers are insurance companies and doctor's offices. That's kind of a middle-sized business that does we do really well with. Um, we have customers all the way from well, one gal insurance office all the way up to the, the county that buys pretty much everything from us. Not everything, but... They buy a lot from us. 
A uh, single biggest customer past a, an institution like that would be Sturm Ruger, buys their office supplies from us, Davidson's, Yavapai Title. Oh, wow. You, know, you, you got some RV. pretty big ones. Yeah, Barrett Propane, That's uh, Pinnacle huge. Bank. We have a lot of good, steady customers. And a lot of these customers are, you know, 15, 20-year customers. They've been very good and very loyal throughout the years. So we, we have the ability to service from the one-girl office to the 400 person office <laughs> and that's that's actually a wide <clears throat> variety especially when you're dealing with prescott because prescott's not huge but it's big enough to go ahead and say hey you guys need office supplies we could get them to you we can go ahead and be efficient and i mean is there any like downtime that you know you have to like be prepared for as far as ordering and i mean because we remember when we were having those issues with uh, uh stuff getting shipped <laughs> oh god yeah we're, we're coming out of that it's been difficult some of the distribution channels you know why they would be out of certain products you just can't understand i guess just shipping or whatever but uh our, our thrust is you know what we have is is a commodity and you, you can buy it anywhere i mean you can get it at walmart you can get it anywhere so what do we do better it, it's pricing and service uh our, our our customers in downtown prescott they have their stuff by nine o'clock i mean the first stop is 801 Mm. Uh, and we can even move that around and we can do special requests that the big guys can't do. Just like Sam calls me up and says, God, I'm out of toner. You know, I, I need it first thing in the morning. I'm so, okay, I can reroute it. You can have it. You can be the 801 guy today. How about that? Yeah, there we go. So, so those, those are some uh, really good accommodations. So having you kind of like on the team, because technically you become a part of the business. I mean, no matter what, some of the businesses can't be run without the, the stuff that they need for their business to run. So it's kind of like you become a part of their business. And so having that confidence and being able to say, you know what, John, I need you, man. I know you're going to come through. So that's kind of like the best thing about you being in business, especially in Prescott. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, um, you know, a lot of our partners or, or customers, you know, that we've been doing well for a long time. So we're, we almost are like, part of the family they're friends and you know we go there some places we go every day we know where to we know who everybody we know their name we know where to put the stuff and we do put it away we do put the paper where you want it not like we just don't leave it at the door like the ups guy will do it and <laughs> our boxes will be in much better shape when they get there than ups i can guarantee you that that is crazy and i know that everybody wants to know do you have a storefront i know the answer but you might as well tell yeah. the community no we don't no we don't we said we you know that's another side of the business that we decided not to take on and we had one in california and we closed it up because we didn't want to be seven days a week, 10 day, ten hours a day business. Our, our focus then was the same. We were deal, dealing with businesses and they were nine to five Monday through Friday. So that's basically what we are. Uh, we're, we're a warehouse, it's, it's a delivery staging area. Most part, a lot of our product comes up with Phoenix overnight. It's kind of a unique process. I mean, anything you order up till five o'clock is pulled and packed labeled in phoenix and is in our warehouse at 6 30 in the morning wow that's so, it, so it's, amazing it's, yeah it's it's quite a process and it's, it's quick and it, it allows us to to be very efficient and that's where we we can save you the money we don't have the big overhead we don't have all the people running around doing all these things i've been in the business forever i've got all kinds of contacts so the pricing should be well we're pretty well connected <laughs> with vendors it, it, it and, will definitely be comfortable yeah so this is one of the coolest things about Prescott, Arizona is like there's a lot of like hidden niches. But at the same time, as more people start moving to Prescott, it's 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 a it's a new way of trying to get the word out. So we are hoping that you guys will hear this podcast and vlogcast and, and go out there and see what he can do for you and your business. And mind you that, you know what, you have uh, him coming to your place, putting stuff into your office and actually making sure that you are uh evenly stocked for the month i mean because you have a monthly uh deal going on or is it is whenever they call you or both or the customers yeah oh they place orders all the time they mostly do it online about 96 percent of our orders come in online i right. uh, take a few phone calls but it's, it's easier and faster that way we have a great website that they can go in they if they have set up all their favorites are there they're all their history is there so they, they can, can go get, back they in can there and get just in press and out of there really quick and get their order place. They can see stock levels. They can see all kinds of, of information there. Uh, our website also provides the Staples retail price that you would get if you went on their site and the and the Office Depot price. And our system. Oh, will, comparison. Oh yeah, our system will automatically 
pick our our normal what we would call street price uh, and and compare it against those, and you get the best of those three. Wow, see that's your best fairly huge. So the, you know, I mean, you're going to save money on 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 the, on you know, the time and and having to go and do the shopping and or whatever it may take, and then you guys could just do it for them. Yeah, that's and awesome. where I come in more is, is do the research. I you know I need this product kind of like this, but I need it to do that, and that's where you call me and then I, I have the expertise in the field. It's like, yeah, you know, I've seen that at a trade show or I know the guy showed me that last time when the Smead guy was in, he had a folder that did that. And um, that's where you, I help you find those things. Once we get it in your favorites, so you never have to look for it again. That is so amazing, man. All right. So once again, tell everybody how to get a hold of you. If you guys haven't seen already, it's been scrolling on the bottom and you guys are more than welcome to do a screenshot, but tell everybody how to get a hold of you. Sure. It's, it's a-1officeplus.com. You log in there. There's a login to order button. It'll ask you for some passwords and so forth, but there's a guest shopper button. If you want your own account, there's an add account button. You just fill out the information. We'll get you all set up so you have all your information always there. Uh, feel free to use the guest. You can call me anytime. I'm at 776-4960 or email me cs at a-1officeplus.com. Boom. He got it right. It was all scrolling down there. I was like, yeah, <laughs> well, maybe I got it right. <laughs> so. With that being said, I am so happy that you guys are watching and you guys are being a part of the more uh, the show. And if you guys want to know more information, feel free to reach out to me and then I'll get you connected with him. Or you can just go straight to these little links that are here at the bottom. And with that being said, I'm out of here. You got anything else to say? Besides well, I just I did forget to mention that we don't play the games that some of the big companies do. So we don't <laughs> have we don't, we don't have restocking charges on returns. A very, very liberal return policy. If you don't want it, we're going to get it out of there and fix it somehow. We don't have minimum orders. We don't have any shipping charges. We just make the whole thing as easy as possible. We've gotten rid of all the little irritations that companies have. Do you, you have a tagline? Like A A1 Plus, does it all for you <laughs> on the cusp <laughs> or something uh, like that we'll get you we'll get you hooked up with one we'll find out where we can go ahead and put that and insert that name somewhere or somehow we will make it happen well what i have on there is your local business source there you go tagline. local baby we're gonna go ahead and make sure we shop local make sure you support the small businesses the big businesses and overall everybody in prescott arizona with that being said make sure you follow us like comment and share and be a part of what we got going on here at the prescott times with that, I'm out. I'll see you later.